Hey guys, Random RC here. Today we will be seeing if new thermal paste and cleaning out a heatsink will improve PC performance. Here is the result of Geekbench. Let's put a computer on a chair and open it up. So here we are taking out the graphics card because that's going to make it a whole lot easier once we take that out. Then we're going to take out the CPU and everything else. Now don't forget to have an anti-static wrist strap and ground yourself before you do this sort of stuff. Now sometimes I'm not actually connected to the anti-static wrist strap. Now once you've grounded yourself you should be fine, just don't do too much moving around. Alright, so now I've got both of them out, I'm going to clean them outside. So here's the heatsink, I'm going to rub it off with um, isopropyl alcohol and we're just cleaning it off here. Now you want to get this really clean. Now, I've actually cleaned it out because I didn't want to deal with a dirty heatsink here. Now I'm taking the thermal paste off of the CPU, make sure we get it all nice and clean. So now I'm going to put some thermal paste on. Now I think I applied a bit too much there, so now let's put the heat sink on. Now I couldn't quite get the fan back in properly, but it should be fine like it is now. Here is the results for the new thermal paste. So there you go, there's the results, it's not that pleasing, there's only a few degrees and there's only a few points in Geekbench. So what can we do to improve the temperatures? Well, a new heatsink overall. So is it worth it going out and getting some thermal paste and reapplying it? Well, it depends. If you're getting really bad thermals, like say 70 degrees or so, then yeah, maybe. But for what I did, no. It just so happened that I had some thermal paste laying around. It is good to get rid of the dust out of your heat sinks though. Did you also notice that I was using Windows 10 technical preview there? If you want to see more of that, subscribe so you make sure you get to see it. Like the video if you like it, dislike it if you disliked it, and leave a comment.